G'day everyone, William Burke here at Sustainable Australia Party HQ. Uh, just uh, getting back into the videos, we've got our admin a little bit more under control now, so I've got a little bit extra time to um, yeah, get some videos out and uh, talk about a few things that are happening. The most important thing happening at the moment is that um, we're trying to register our party as a state party uh, for the upcoming South Australian election. So I've highlighted the pinned post on our Facebook page. Um, if you want to have a, a look at our Facebook page or um, click on that when you get a minute. But uh, the local government elections in New South Wales have been delayed by three months due to COVID. So that's given us a bit more time to really focus on South Australia. And we need it because we've got to get 200 members by um, early September. So we've got to virtually double our membership in a really short space of time. So we're going to need your help. It's only $22 uh, or $11 concession, um, which is obviously a senior, a concession or unemployed. So uh, do join up um, and help us to get over the line there. But I'll just talk you through briefly this, this Facebook post here, uh, which is pinned. So it's talking about, you know, our SA party, um, and we're obviously campaigning to protect our environment, to stop overdevelopment and stop corruption. And we do need around 100 new members to get over 200, um, really by the end of August. So we've got about a month to do it. Not a long time. Um, it's now or never, um, basically, if we want to be successful in South Australia. And the way that the upper house works there is we've got a decent chance of getting elected. We'd need around 5% of the vote. Um, the last party got the last seat in the upper house with around 5%. So we'd need to lift our vote a little bit, but um, Adelaide's not a huge place like Sydney, Melbourne, Brisbane, so we can really spend some money carefully and get a good result, I think. But, yeah, make sure you click on our, um, on our uh, Facebook link uh, and it talks about what we're campaigning on and, and all the links. So just, just have a, a look there. There's a couple of comments here. Ray saying, do we know any of your team? Obviously... We've got Clifford Hayes uh, in Parliament in Victoria doing a great job. And we've got an uh, event coming up this Sunday, the 1st of August, our usual first Sunday of the month events. So if I click on that, it opens up uh, our website where you can RSVP. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to happen this Sunday. Just um, turn up at the front of the Archer Hotel in North Adelaide. Uh, and Simone Dunsford will be there to, to meet people hand out a map and just go off in pairs and do uh, roughly an hour of, of letterboxing and then come back basically at, at around four o'clock and we'll just do a little bit of a chat, um, have a drink, talk about our registration um, and we've got a, a couple of other surprises to talk about as well. So do make sure you um, RSVP, obviously send RSVP, there's already a, uh, around 10 people RSVP'd and we want to roughly double that. So yeah, make sure you do RSVP. It's a it's a good little um, Sunday afternoon, couple of hours late Sunday afternoon in um, in North Adelaide. Interestingly, I was having a look at the register of political parties in South Australia. This is the uh, Electoral Commission of South Australia website, and the register. There's only eight parties registered. Okay, Labor, Liberal, National, Greens, Animals, SA Best. Advance SA and Child Protection Party. So there's no real centrist sort of party um, prioritising our environment or, or standing up for the community on issues like overdevelopment and corruption. So there's a big gap in the market there. I'd expect a couple of other parties to register in the meantime, but if we can get um, Sustainable Australia Party registered in South Australia, I've got, I think we've got a really decent chance of getting uh, an MP elected in the Upper House. So... Yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about today. Just do make sure you um, check out our, our SA page on our website. You can, you can basically click here and it takes you straight through to um, our website. On our new website we launched a few months ago now, it's going really well. We've got a simple menu under Get Involved, States and Territories, and then it opens up to here, South Australia. So do have a bit of a look. Uh, next South Australian election is on 19th of March 2022, but you have to put in your application six months before to qualify. Uh, we'll then be able to run for local council uh, later next year, 
Uh, but yeah, we need to recruit 100 new members in August, basically. So we've got about four weeks to get it. I really encourage you to um, join if you're in South Australia, uh, share our Facebook, uh, comment on the Facebook page if you've got any questions or comment on this post if you've got any questions. But yeah, let's get, um, let's get our fifth state slash territory uh, registration and contest the South Australian election next year. All right, that's enough from me. Have a good one and we'll talk soon. Thank you.